Hey there everyone, this is Alcal playing VIP6 and let's go back to World 1. Like, I was, I kept pushing and pushing, but I do genuinely wish to return to World 1. And I kind of want to see how it loops back on things and whatever. Uh, for those who do not watch VLDCX, I'm playing with a different controller now, the X91 uh, Xbox One controller Mega Man theme that I got for uh, Christmas. I've done this because... BFO! Because, uh... Whoa, that boom start, like, didn't last long. Instruction man, D-pad move, speed up, explode, and reversed movement. What does that mean? Anyway, yeah, so, like... My movement and I can explode. Why do I want to explode? Why is that a function that is... Okay, so it's boom fide object or something? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so... Dang it. There's the button to explode by accident. What is going on here? Well, riding a UFO, that's pretty rad. Time limit is very short, so there's like, probably not a whole lot to this. I'm enjoying the sun there. So yeah, reverse control, get money, I'm still got big laws, got it, just pass through the saw blades, I guess. So many suns in the sky! Okay, there might be some screen looping shenanigans, dang it. Wait, I keep getting hurt, wait, can you just keep getting hurt? There's a fun sun there and there's a guy being happy. Can I just take unlimited hits? Is that normal? But I can blow up. Okay. Ko... Ko... Kojima? Why are you here? What is going on? And I won! I didn't have to explode! I could, but I didn't need to. I could hit all the things in the universe. And now the path has opened. <laughs> what I have? Levels names for boon flying object. Okay. Background and lettering at uh, and both relate to the Japanese chain store Kojima, which sells home electronics. Fantastic. Now I understand. Is it- was I supposed to be invulnerable to just being always be beyond reproach in terms of morality? Except when I exploded? Unnatural blessing. <laughs> Let's- Oh, it's an upside down low. Let's not ask further questions. Like, yeah, I can still get shrunk, so... There's not like something crazy that happened. Hey, someone's flinging some poo. All right, unnatural means upside down. Check it out, it's a VIP coin. And this weird, gross sludge water reminds me of home. <laughs> That's kind of the dark thing to say on the subtleness. I mean, the lands behind are just like normal glaciers. Oh, secret one up of the factory. Because I got a yellow switch, I can get you without too much harm. Without too much risk. This is kind of a low-key, okay life farm if I need it in the early game. Like, it's not automated, so it's still not what I would prefer, but... I mean... It's just handing out mushrooms, and because of the switch, I don't have to get worried about kickball. Alright, look at, look at all this generosity. What is going on here? Unnatural is my friend. Please send out the anti-druid. We will collect baseball cards and compare commercialized football chains. Uh, I guess I can go up here like this. Oh, there's a goal there. Will that trigger it? Yes, it will. Because of the three arrows, I'm thinking that the secret exit is merely the act of flying on- Whoa! Shut down the universe! It's all dark now! <laughs> Alright, well... Yeah, I think that the secret exit is just get to the end of the level and uh, enjoy this delicious mom baked pie. Hey, there's even magic mushroom here just for you. It's, a, it's in the shape of an apple though, so cops won't find out what it is. There we go. I couldn't start select. Um. I don't know. I wonder if any of the shells are blue. 
your men to light, Yoshi fly. That child guy's color early green. Cause there is like a guy with like a weird Well, the shell is the color of the weird rank water. Alright, okay. There we go. And then one right here. Yeah, you get blue shells like all over the place. There we go, just carefully get, get more lives. And look at this prize! Yeah! There you go, just follow the clues, man. Did that... Did that do anything? <laughs> I mean... Did something was supposed to happen? Let's finish World 1, I guess. Like, I can't tell if something was supposed to happen. Oh. Uh, welcome to Warland 4. Oh, this is gaudy. I'm currently too occupied with a coupling rating. I may be inclined to squeeze you in if you collect the five whatever coins. Alright, so is that something you have to do in this level? I don't know what's going on at all. Let's look around the world. Alright, so yeah, th maybe that's it. It's like weird little puzzle rooms to get the whatever coin. Oh, oh shoot. Well, got a cape. Eh, they tried... Well, maybe they succeeded. No, they didn't. <laughs> they tried to make it, looks like, so you can't just use a cape, but look at that. I did it anyways, just gonna poke my nose and touch it and fly away. Alright, so we got this weird, fancy, weird, brand new PlayStation 3 place. Where there's gonna be doors with challenges inside. Possibly? I don't know what I'm doing at all. Oh, okay, so this is a copy. Got it. Okay, so here, be careful. And there's gonna be a swamp. And that's right, I'm in the pink zone. I recognize the pink zone as a legal entity. Sometimes I'm just gonna spend forever. That's gonna help me tell me where I am. And I can tell it. There you go, I escape. Alright, just... Yeah. Okay. Um... I don't know where I am anymore. Okay. okay should be living. Should be good. This is a clever way to do this. I like it. Hey, I made it through the pink thing place. And I emerge at a place I don't recognize. Check it out, you can bop these if you want. Right here, I need to find a piece switch or something. I don't know what I'm doing at all. It's Hammett. He says lol. Oh boy, is this really what's happening? I hope there's like more than one. Because otherwise you can make that impossible. I mean, this is assuming I'm doing the right thing. Maybe this is a trap of some kind? Can you, yeah, I don't think you could just slide underneath. So in that case, I do hope there's more than one because he could appear and like just destroy like the one that has one. That is extremely beyond its abilities. And he responds. I'm just bopping my head on blocks. He says lol. That he does. Man, yeah, there's a lot of blocks here. This is what is happening. There we go, I found it. It wasn't one of the blocks. Wow! <laughs> Shh. Don't appear like that. I think you could have a little bit more variety in the content of these blocks, though. Like, have one have, like, a mushroom. That'd be pretty rad. Alright, three out of something. Is there, like... There's, like... Oh, there. Um... Is there, like, power-ups in these? That would be nice. And you are nice. Well, there you go. It's mushrooms, but, like, I'll take it. So I've done this guy. There's a statue. He's having fun. There's a P-switch. This is the P-switch room! That's a thwimp. It's not a P-switch at all. This is just weird old shapes in the mall. Whoa, there we go. 
This is like the level part of the level. Okay, it's just kind of hanging out there. Alright. Uh, safest way to do this? Thusly. Yeah, just ignore everything. Yeah, I can do weird super tight jumps, or I can just do a bonus and invite this into my life. Okay, that I didn't foretell. So am I supposed to press this P-Switch, or... Like, I don't know if I want to take that chance. Because this is a lot harder with carrying a P-Switch around, because you can't rely on spin jumps all the time to keep you safe, like, a little bit, but not as well. I go here, and yeah, mess that one up. Yeah, that's how I will call that one mess up. Well, at least bing bags having fun. Swim just exists. No, yeah, so you need to bring it here to go back in the door. I just kind of completely forgot that detail that my door, my way out, was just floating in the sky. All right, well, I mean, you refuel me with mushrooms, so I can't really complain. Um, missing one prize somewhere in the universe. Where could it be? So that's the one where it wants me to bring all my stuff. Yeah, there's not a door here, at the very least not yet. I haven't tried to go in the main door yet, in case that, like, that breaks something. Uh, have I went in that extremity? Like, here? Probably. Yes, I have. Huh, where have I not been, then? I've been here. Yeah, I remember the shell next to the door. I've been here. Whoops! Oh, shoot! Well, this is terrible because my time is getting real low. I'm probably gonna die of timeout. I didn't mean to go in here. Like, I just pressed up by accident. Uh, this controller's up. It's kind of very fragile. I think I'd rather just die and not have that time guillotine hanging over my head. Like, I'd rather just redo everything. Can you just go in the main door? No, a dog is barking at you. Is there something here near the statue? Oh, one of them isn't even in a room. There you go. Solve that puzzle. Cape so much. What? Really? I, uh, okay, so I lost track of where I was there. Nah, I knew it. See, this becomes a lot less hard when you know exactly where it is. issue whether I could do it or not. It's if I wanted to do it or not. That's what mattered. Dang it. I felt like I got flung there. But now I know this has a question. Um, does the game just let you go through if you die post getting all the dragon points? There I got touched in a really stupid way that I could avoid. I guess we're gonna find out. It's not impossible that I might die here. Like, it's not free. It's World 1 Castle, and it's far from free. It's not the hardest thing in the universe, but, like, I didn't die on purpose there, you know? Like, it just it just happened. Um, I got all the Dagadon. It's on the meter. Maybe it'll just let me go in? Okay. Alright. Hey! Everyone is so happy for me. They're cheering in long form. All right, here we go. Doing platforming across blocks in space. Yeah, is this, you know, it's not an easy level. And it, it just keeps on going. The standards between levels and castles seems different. 
Uh, yeah, I landed on the statue, which caused me to touch the fire. Help. Kind of messy, but I love it. Like, this, you know, it's kind of fun. Look, look. People out there making, you know, levels for contests. If you want a, a five trial kind of thing, that's how you do it. Really short, really punchy. Like, that's how you want it to be done. Uh, doing five little biomes it can be a lot of fun to do, but this is a more, I would call it, successful way of doing this. Like, regardless of, like, individual quality and whatnot, or presentation or whatever, just the sheer core of what it is you're trying to do. This is not something, by which I mean the exact opposite. Yeah, here we go! Final rating! Alright, we're rating all the coupling, so... I don't know who determined this, but uh, these are all top class. But, uh, Wendy is just not worth the screen time. Oh, that's rude! It's her castle and everything, too. Well, I guess that's why we're having a... That's not Wendy. Uh, that's a cat. Long... Uh, is she, like, invisible? Yeah, what is going on here? Because there's only two robots coming up. Or was she a cat? She's not worth the screen time, so she doesn't appear? I am not sure. Yeah, yeah, she... <laughs> the real one just does not appear. So, if you know your patterns by heart, where, where robots are and where she is, I guess it's not gonna be too hard. I just... Improvised. <laughs> wow, okay. No, yeah, like, the whole experience here was like harder and everything was removed. That's still funny. I don't know what's going on anymore. She got a mighty fine castle for a third rate coupling, or should I say, used to? And the voice says, eek, don't, and then click. And so, va so Wendy vanished into thin air. LOL! This was highly confusing, but we just gave that hill a headache. Okay, and that just leads straight back to World 2 in that way, so I did just kind of skip a whole lot of thing with World 2. Or you can also go here. This game is so open, it's giving me a headache. I forgot to read the text! As this is a second recording, just so I can press the select button. The references to raiding couplings and Wendy's invisibility are based on Japanese variety show Gainujin Kazukuzicek, and a, a panel of famous performers are rated by a set of quiz questions. The lowest rating is not worth the screen time, and anyone receives it will probably disappear from the stage in a puff of computer-generated information smoke. Well, computer-generated images, not, you know, CGI smoke. Well then, I guess the pun with Wendy being invisible. I guess, though, wow, like, for a World 1 fight, that was pretty, like, extreme for a boss, honestly. 